Canada. A warm welcome, please, for Piper Gillis and Paul Poirier. Runners up to Weaver and Poirier in Canadian Nationals. And just behind them here, a couple of marks behind them after the rhythm dance. Piper Gillis and uh, Paul Poirier. Music from uh, Don McLean for these two. Start. I love that start every time I see it. Starry, starry night, paint your blood blue and gray. Look out on a summer's day with eyes that know the darkness in my soul, shadows on the hill. Catch the trees in a daffodil Catch the breeze in a winter chills In colors on a snowy thin land Now I understand What you try to say to me Now you suffer for your sanity how you tried to set them free They would not listen They did not know Great use of the rules there to create some innovative twizzles Starry, starry night Lovely entry to that lift. They look just so relaxed out there and at ease with their content and performance. Going into that one foot section there with tremendous amount of speed. Now I think I know what you try to say to me. How you suffer for your sanity. How you try to set them free. They would not listen. They're not listening still. Perhaps they never Lovely. Really, really good. They always like to do something a little bit different.
this one you mentioned to me earlier on that, that earlier on in the year that starry starry night would last four minutes Ladies and gentlemen, hold Piper your interest and Paul I wouldn't have believed you but it did yeah I, I'm always surprised I like this program as much as I do to be honest very honest of me but it's it's true I, I on paper I didn't think I would but I do but I don't think that's just the music or how they skate it. If you watch their choreography, it's very clever. For me, when I see it, I see that there's a lot of complementary choreography. And quite often, you think that each skater has to be doing steps in tandem all the time. If you watch these two back, you have moments where she's doing difficult steps and he's doing a spread eagle, for example, a step on two feet, and then they alternate which allows them time to breathe and flow and express. And everything looks very in control and calm. And I, I really like that about the way this program is put together. Yeah, really strong. And they've uh, been marked highly. <laughs> How would you compare that to Weaver Pojo? Very then? difficult, isn't it? I Technically, it looks like they've got it over yeah. Weaver and Berger. Remember, they start a couple of points, two and a half points behind them after the rhythm dance. I wouldn't like to call it, but I might have preferred this better. I think I'd have to watch them both back again. See the entry there, so simple yet so clever. Not, yes. not simple to do, obviously, but... No, and it was never too intricate. No, that's, that's what's clever about it. It's been very well thought out. That is very difficult, though, rotating a girl and lifting one foot up. He should be credited for that tremendously. Must have been bitterly disappointed to lose out to Weaver and Poget in the Nationals. Can they get their revenge here? So important for them leading up to the World Championships in Saitama next month, which of course you can see in their entirety here on Eurosport. So, this Weaver and Poget got 123. They're going to need 125 Canada. minimum. Free dance score 124.40. It's first this place, but I think it's going to be second overall. Their total score 202.45. They're currently in yeah. second place. Oh. Just been beaten overall. How disappointing is that? What a shame. I wonder what the deduction was for. So Weaver and Proje lead at the